get in there. There we go. Yay! <laughs> Finally! Uh, you know what, I bet I just got unlucky with that uh, first hit I did. Slamming into him, flying at super speed. I bet for most people doing that, he would have just gone into the fires. But no. For me, I ended up knocking him clear across it to the other side, where he was just free to boom tube away and bring in more and more and more of his forces to fight against me. But we finally beat him. Just had to fight against an army to do so. And there's no army big enough to stop Superman. A gun battle at Bruno Mannheim's old warehouse, the abduction of several top scientists within Metropolis, and now a raid on the research facilities at LexCorp. Superman and the Special Crimes Unit have scoured the city in search of the missing scientists and their kidnappers, so far without success. Superman appears to be out of his depth, sire. The mortal Luthor is proving to be a rather inventive ally. Perhaps too inventive. It is an admirable quality, albeit driven by greed. As surely as Superman will fall, Lex Luthor's activities must be closely monitored. Do I make myself clear, Kanto? Yes, sire. Well, that raid on Lex Labs blows our theory out of the water. It would seem that the scientists there are at risk too. Thankfully, Superman was there last night. It could have been much worse. Those innerbots have to be working for someone. Yeah, well, for once I'm fresh out of ideas. Whoa! What is that? Yep, uh, clock's just gone to get the scoop, that's all. Oh boy. Volcanic eruption or something? We're gonna have to save people from lava pouring over or some sort of doomsday device I better take a closer look oh yeah I, I knew he'd have to do that drill down into the earth using his body spinning super fast yeah mountain strike some sort of doomsday b device beneath it let's shut that thing off yep this all seems fairly typical for an underground lair where everything's going wrong. Lava pouring out of cracks in the side. Bunch of turrets shooting at everything. What's happening here? Uh, I'm not coming out until this area is safe, Superman. But why is everything going wrong? Why are all these defenses turning on its master? Oh, unless, of course, the Interbots are back in town. So they've hacked into all the defences here, or something. And they're causing everything to go absolutely haywire. Oh, actually, instead of... Yeah. Instead of blasting them off... Oh, well, these guys are a little bit too far away from the ledges, so I'll just do that. Yeah, but for these enemies that are by the ledges, what if I just blow them off so they fall into the lava below? Oh, look at him. Poor guy. Okay, so where are um, some more en enemies? because they're not appearing as blips on my radar, although I can hear them shooting at me still. Okay, that's the turrets dealt with. Are there any more baddies just... milling around on the walkways? I don't think so. I think that may be everyone. So, let's speak with you. You okay? Oh, no. Can't talk with you or anything. Alright, I'll see about these control panels. Can I interact with them at all? Nope. Hmm. What do I need to do here then? Let's try using my x-ray vision. Nope, I can't peer through this wall. Oh, 
Oh, maybe I need to plug the lava up somehow. Mm, nope. Blowing at it doesn't seem to be doing the job. Let's go to the pause menu, destroy the gun emplacements, and plug the lava spills in the walls by using boulders. Okay. There we go. Good old pause menu telling me what I need to do. Ah, you know what? That probably would have helped back in that uh, gas attack mission. Oh, no, no, no. Come back here. Come back here. Come back here. Come back here. Give me... Ah, damn it. It's sinking away. Okay, let's find another boulder then. Alright, I need to get closer to the leaks before I can properly plug them. Okay, is that a boulder hanging out just here? Yep. Okay, let's try this again. So let's get really, really up close to it. And there we go, plugged. Yeah, I was thinking about using my super breath, but it's not very good at freezing things up. I don't have freeze breath, just super breath. That's more for launching enemies away from me and putting out fires. Not going to do much against lava. Okay, so one more left, and then we'll see if there's anything else I have to do. Or if the scientist will now feel safe enough. To tell me what's going on. There we go, I've activated a cutscene. Onto the next portion of the mission. Oh. Ah, coolant barrels. Would have been a lot easier if I just had access. Oh, let's just blow all these guys away. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oop, there you go. Ooh, and there's some fire spewing out of that grate. Yeah, it'd be a lot easier if I had freeze breath. Okay, so throw that in there. Hmm. Let's try again. Oh, are these uh, freezing barrels? Or is this just a big crate? Big metal crate that's not actually going to do anything. Yeah, it just it, it just exploded into nothingness. Okay, so coolant barrels. So let's try again. Just throw it in there. Ah, there we go. Okay. So it it did work. It just takes multiple barrels to do the job. Ooh. Oh, not when they're spewing out fire, though. Not when they're erupting. Doesn't work then. So I actually have to wait for the eruption to stop. Yeah, this game has got a lot going on for it. I really like it. And one. Oh, no, that actually did it. Just one each. I guess uh, on that first time I used it, an eruption must have happened just as the barrel made contact. And job... Never mind, job not done. Maybe I just had a little bit of a bad angle. And I like that I can just fly over and through all this fire and all this lava and it's not really affecting me. Only these amazing weapons from Apocalypse, only they can do the job of actually harming me. There we go. Okay, you mind telling me what's Thank going on? Men. If you can find my two colleagues, we can teleport you to the reactor using this experimental portal generator. Once you're in the reactor area, you must help Professor Hamilton shut down the reactor before it goes critical. Hamilton? Emil Hamilton of Star Labs? Yes, that's right. The Interbots had him working on some kind of reactor of theirs. I think that's what caused this mess. Hurry, Superman, there isn't much time. 
Ah, okay. So this is where at least some of the scientists were taken. I need to find the scientists and destroy every trace of this Interbot army. Oh, don't worry. Way ahead of you. Ooh. And some more of those floating mines. And no time limit, so I don't need to worry too much. Yeah, so the scientists were kidnapped and at least some of them were taken here, working on some kind of reactor. I don't know if it's all gone wrong or... Ah, damn it, some of them do self-destruct. I need to remember that. Yeah, I don't know if it's all gone wrong or if this is what the Interbots had intended to create some sort of eruption that would cause a tsunami or, you know, something. Jeez. Aren't there any actual differences between these enemies for me to be able to tell if they're going to self-destruct or not? Yeah, he just did a little explosion. Oh, okay. Well, some of them definitely flash red. Okay, let's find the control panel for this. You know what, it might even be on the other side. Let's see, can I spot anything? Nope. Let's try using my x-ray vision, if I can actually... Nope, can't peer through these walls. Alright, I don't think the solution is here. I've been checking out that wall and everything that's beyond it for ages. So the solution must be in this room. Maybe, or I still overlooked something. And yeah, can't work my way back. And these giant containers... Okay, I can't damage them or anything. And I can't look inside them either. They must be lead-lined. Okay, what about all these metal... Nope. Can't peer inside them. Oh. There we go. And boom. So, some of the boxes destroyed. Oh, hey guys, more forces coming to play. Well, that's fine. I'll just have to smash the hell out of all of you. Ooh, I know what to do here. Blow you back it. Oh, is that doing any damage to you? Oh, little tiny bits of damage, setting you on fire. Okay, I'm pretty much just playing a game with him at this point. Oh, is he finally done? No, okay, let's just beat him up. There we go. You're done now. And I'm through. Deactivate all five laser grids. Okay. What will I be doing after I deactivate the laser grids, though? Am I releasing scientists by doing that? Are they all being held prisoner on the other side of them? Oh, hey, flying things. Now I know how to deal with you. This shouldn't be too much of a problem. Okay, let's just take out all the heavy defences first. And once again, once you've finished doing one of those big attacks, it takes a second before you can do anything else. Superman's just a little bit stunned from the impact. Okay, let's find some more tanks. The turrets, ah, they're fine. They're not too much of a problem, but the tanks and the choppers, oh yeah, they're definitely pretty tough. Oop, jeez. Oh, can I knock you down to the ground below? Eh, I guess I'll just blow you up then. Oh, and let's see, is there anything behind? No, I can't use Mike's ray vision. So I think all these extra 
compartments around the sides. It's just for show. Hopefully, a ton of enemies won't be coming to play. Okay, if you're that desperate for me to beat the hell out of you, I'll come say hello. That's fine. He slightly managed to dodge my attacks, strafing around, weaving in and out. Oh yeah, some of them, they just explode instantly. There's no warning. They don't flash red or anything like that. They just explode straight away. Okay, so I think that's just about everyone. Apart from you two. Let's just blow you off, see if the fall does you in. Yep. Ah, well, it did one of them in. Ah, spoke too soon. Okay, so the side compartments, they do open. And, yep, more enemy forces coming to play, but that's fine. Because it's just revealing the control panels that I need to destroy. So, if anything, these guys are helping me out. They're just helping me out. Oh boy, more and more enemy forces. Just all the time, non-stop. <laughs> well, got rid of that one, sort of. It was mostly the mine exploding in my face that did it in, but 